Welcome. In front of me is a Xiaomi Redmi Note 9T and today I'll show you how to bypass the Google verification on this phone. Now, Xiaomi doesn't really have the greatest protection right here, so once you connect to Wi-Fi just to see this kind of uh, verification right here, as you can see I do have a pattern or a Google account. So to basically bypass this, all we need to do is turn off our Wi-Fi. It's kind of as simple as it gets. So we'll me quickly progress to Wi-Fi. Forget my network. Skip. And from here, you want to set up a screen lock. So I'm gonna set up only screen lock. And as you've seen, uh, one of the ways of unlocking the device was using a pattern. So I'll go with a pen, just to keep it a little bit different. I'm gonna set something relatively simple. There we go. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Once you set it up, you can then go back and reconnect to your Wi Fi. And there we go, now I'm connected. And once we progress again with the setup, look at that. We can now unlock our device using a pen instead of the pattern that was previously blocking us. So, one, two, three, four. And look at that, we can finish up the setup. Now, this basically unlocks the device. Uh, not very secure, but there we go. Uh, no, still, once you finish up the setup, it is still recommended that you perform a factory reset of the device through settings, just to remove the old account uh, fully, because it is still somewhere in the device and the memory. So, performing a reset of it through settings will completely get rid of it. Now once I finish up the setup, I'll show you where you can find this option. Okay, so let's open up settings from here. Scroll all the way down to additional settings. Or not. Oh, there we go. So it's, as you can see, under About Phone. Uh, factory Reset right here. Then select Erase All Data. You'll need to confirm that PIN or whatever you have chosen as your locking method uh, once again. So there we go. One, two, three, four. Press Next. And then you need to just wait uh, 10 seconds here to press Next. And then another 10 seconds to press OK, which will begin the process. Now, I won't be going through it on the camera right here, just because it honestly just goes through a factory reset and then brings you back to the setup screen, which I'm pretty sure you already know how to set up your device. So really not much any like information in that. So anyway, this is how you basically bypass the Google verification right here. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.